Lindsay is arriving like the regal queen that she is. What award have we picked up, Lindsay? Northern England Businesswoman of the Year. Businesswoman of the Year. What an exciting title to be winning. And look how gorgeously this red goes against this blue colour, can I just say. We wear it well, don't we? You wear it very well indeed. Now, how did it feel to get up on that stage in front of all those people and win this today? That was absolutely amazing because I think, like I said to you before, I'm kind of accepting this on behalf of the, the disabled entrepreneur community because there's an army of us out there doing all this work and it's just really lovely to be in among this audience with some fantastic women in there. The stories and the businesses, it's just overwhelming. It's wonderful and I can't thank them enough. What's the best story that you've heard so far? Oh, goodness. There was a lady that works, she has her own brewery. Um, we're sat with a lady who's going singing on a yacht for a month. She's a singer and an artist. And it, there's just so many great stories out there. And if there is anything, um, a message that you would like to give to maybe disabled women going into business, what would that be? There are lots of us out there, so you're, you'll be part of a, a very strong army of people who are doing it. They're out there every day working hard, so never feel that you're the only one putting in 18-hour days because there's lots of people doing it as well. <gasps> Look at that beautiful message from Lindsay. Now, final question. Will you be back next year, Lindsay? I, I, I hope so. Goodness, I hadn't even thought about it. I'll have to buy another dress. I mean, oh no, oh no, what will we do? We'll have to buy no dresses. <laughs> we'll, be back. we'll be back next year. Fantastic. Well, listen, I will leave you to get back to the celebrations. A huge congratulations from us. Well done. Thank you so much. Thank you.